Hello. Hey. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up, everybody? Welcome tonight to the Stealing Fire Podcast. Stealing Fire Stealing fucking Fire. podcast. I'm your host, VJ Nerd. One episode. Here we go. One episode. Uh, Riot. My name is Frankie. My name is uh, also oh, Frankie, <laughs> aka, AKA Ranks, aka Ranksy. Uh, my name is Brandon, and I go by Watchlogger. Hell yeah, motherfuckers. So, <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> okay, so to, to clarify this a little bit, like we, we've done uh, two or three weeks already. Yeah. yeah. Touring. Well, you, you actually started earlier, uh, right? Well, one or two weeks before you? Two weeks before him, right? Something like that? I don't know. Ish. Like one weekend, wasn't it? I don't, I don't know. know. We can't keep track. <laughs> we don't know. We don't know. I should know this. this Check the itinerary. Yeah, 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 that's <laughs> going to. Check the itinerary. Yeah, so, so for me, this is the second week. So we did Washington, two shows, New York, Orlando, and mm-hmm. we, I just played... Uh, Electricity. Oh, yeah, oh, well, and yesterday, yesterday we did medicine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Almost about to anymore. Anymore. Electricity's <laughs> tonight, <laughs> yeah. Everybody's so sleep, yeah. sleep de- deprived and shit. And, uh, yeah, so I, I play, just played electricity, as you can see by my face. I'm super sweaty. But, uh, yeah, that was super fun. Like, it was rammed already. This is, so, this, this yeah, is, one, this is one of my top two. I'm not naming names. I'm just letting them know. This is <laughs> top two of the whole tour so far for me. Oh, yeah, same for me. Was New York the best show of your life? or New York is up there tied for one of the best shows of my life. And the other one it's tied with is also a New York show. <laughs> oh, nice. Hell yeah. yeah. Just for the context, right well, just he is from New York. The, the only, I am, well, I was born uh, born here, uh, born here for not at home. We're in, uh, I was born in LA, raised in New York, but um, uh it's just I got the parents got to come out and see what 13 years of work has culminated into thanks to these beautiful people and uh, yeah that that made it so fucking special yeah Yeah. and what does Squirtle say about that (laughs) (laughs) this is the best moment to do this podcast because I'm so sore from the last night and I mean I'm ready to go on stage it's gonna be fun but uh yeah, I'm so sore. I'm so tired, but it's, I, I know that once I go on stage, I'll have all the energy. Um, so yeah, I'm very happy though to be surrounded by all these people and friends. This is awesome. Yeah. This is a, Can you do the mic for him? You know, and I'll do my I, mic. For yeah, nice. Session. I don't know if you know Brandon. Um, well, he's a Tiger. former child. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yes, former child. Yeah, former child. <laughs> very unique not all of us have that background yeah yeah <laughs> frank and frank which has been very fun to have a tour with two franks two franks yeah, one tour. Two tour. always two franks, one tour. will always prefer and uh carmen doing the visuals absolutely killing oh, it man. every night uh dealing with a lot of bullshit yeah, every night yeah. <laughs> i know i know we're I in know, a couple I, hats I, I don't mean to cut you off i know that uh i said this night has been one of my top two it has but just this experience as a whole has been the best experience of my life. Yeah. Like, it's like, it's just, I'm, it's hard to not get emotional talking about it. It's like, the same for me. It's, like, it's been unfucking believable. Like, it's just so nice. Like, we, we, we both, I think, we come for like day job things. So, like, yeah. when we have a show that's like a single show sometimes, and like now we're like two months like fully into it. So, every day you get to, you, you wake up and you're like, oh, I'm gonna make music. And like, in, in an hour, I'm gonna be like, in the green room with Val and he's gonna show me all the amazing things yeah, on his yeah, laptop I, like, I, 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 I wanna talk on that real quick I don't wanna overtake this podcast but I just wanna say being on this tour cause I've spent a lot of time with Val and Carmen in the past especially Val and, and he's always working on music but uh, I've been te- I never, yeah so I mean, the thing is I've been telling a lot of people that aren't on this tour or aren't in the music or pursuing anything uh, artistically I'm like dude this guy is doing this thing 24-7. And when I say 24-7, it's maybe barely an over-exaggeration. It's not. <laughs> and it's not. And, 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 and I'm telling you, it's like everyone regards this guy as the guy. And you, the reason for it is because he does it more often and more consistently all the time yeah. than everyone ever and the first few stops, I was like, yeah, I'm just going to hang. And then I'm just like, 
I feel no. terrible about myself. Yeah, I, need to to make music. On, I need to work on music this whole time. <laughs> I, like, I remember this moment when we went in uh, Orlando in Vanguard. There was this hospitality lady and she was super kind. Don't get me wrong, but she was like, oh, guys, do you need something like this? Do you need something like that? Do you need uh, this or do you need that? And we're like, no, no, we're good. No, we're good. It was just three guys on the laptop, like on the road. Everybody she she, just, she yeah. was just like, this is the easiest <laughs> thing I've ever done. Like yeah. the easiest night in hospitality. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, I can vouch for a lot of this right now. I remember doing a 12 plus hour day, I think with you guys at EDC this year. And on yeah. the bus ride home at five, six in the morning, you were still making brand new racks. <laughs> you were still showing me how to automate like nine different things through key triggering. And I just, six in the morning, it's, you yeah. really don't stop. It was the same this morning on the airport. We, were, uh, we had two oh. hours sleep. And then right before we were to board, we're on our laptop speakers were, uh, talking about how to make different subs <laughs> in like car <laughs> like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> in a I feel like that's why me and Val get along. Like he's actually with a laptop yeah. right now. I feel oh, like special so. guest. Okay. Uh, hey. We're filming. Hi. We're filming. We're filming. Come on, Sorry. Come on, come on in. in. Come on in. Come on in. Hey. We're filming. Hold on. We're Watch filming. Just give us oh, wait. Hold on. We're, we're, we're filming. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Hold on. I mean, you can join if you want to. We'll give you hugs in two seconds. Okay. All right, so um, I was going to say is uh, I think that's one of the reasons that me and Val always get along too is because it's always like we come back from the show and it's like, it's 4 a.m. Do we get three hours of sleep or do we just work on visuals and do we work on music for the show tomorrow and make it even sicker? And I feel like the fact that we're always on that same vibe and energy it's is awesome. every time. Yeah, it's always, it's always the, it's never, the sleep never gets picked, it's, ever. It's really the inspiring. Yeah, how you guys work, too. It's not just necessarily, like, you know, utilizing, you know, just Ableton. It's like, I've watched you guys both pull up C4D. Mm -hmm. I've watched you guys pull up Resolume. I've watched you guys pull up multiple different programs and continuously put out work, even when I know you're tired as hell. You've been traveling a lot. Yeah. You've been traveling a lot. And it's like, yeah. that's, it's truly remarkable, because it's it like. Never stops. I, I count myself out sometimes. I'm just like, yo, these, these motherfuckers keep going. But as a general, I did want to say for this, uh, tour that I you know we put a lot of effort into coming up with everybody that's going to be a part of it from the support that. from everyone involved and you know there was a lot of back and forth and it was a lot of effort to figure out the perfect team and I every single day I'm grateful because I know that from our laser guy from the lighting guy from every support artist we've had on this tour that I think that I made perfect choices and I can't even imagine making more perfect choices for team because like everybody is so amazing and I've never felt so close to a team ever and I've been on a lot of tours so that's saying something yeah. you just took you just, in eight years you just took the words out of my mouth I was literally about to say that I was going to say that the the team and support lineup that Carmen acquired and worked her ass off to get together for this shout Had, out Carmen shout out Carmen all the dude <laughs> the, the boss dog okay <laughs> like a f animal so good at what she does but um it's just every single person I've met on this tour it's like it, they they felt like family halfway it's, through the yeah. first fucking day <laughs> and an hour an hour and, 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 I was gonna say you really cultivated a very family ass yeah. scenario right now it, and I really love that it, it, it's been it's been because I, I I felt comfortable it's my first tour ever, and I felt really comfortable off the bat because it's with Carmen and Val, and they're two of my very close friends, and I've loved them for so long, and I'm very comfortable with them. Um, but there was, I was a little nervous, right? It's like, it's like there's a bunch of new people I'm meeting, and it's like, first time doing this, I hope they like me, you know? And, but, but it was, it was just, it, because of who, who Carmen acquired for this and put together for this, it, every, I'm, I, love everyone so much like it's it's yeah. just it's fucking oh, beautiful yeah. these people perfect these, selection of weirdos yeah perfect yes. perfect selection of weirdos and the, I miss the, everybody when they're gone yeah, like when, they're, our, when our laser guy's gone Mer or our yeah. lighting guy Cam I'm just like oh man I wish they were here right now but, I miss them so much th like. this experience from towards the end of day one I'd say I felt in like my heart this is Family for life, yeah, like it, 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 just, it just, it just, it just. I just felt, I just felt so embraced. Like you know, first tour. I'm not a big name. I, I didn't, you know, I'm not like fucking popping. I'm not special. And and and, and, and well, no, no, but no, but, no, but, but like everyone was so supportive, embraced me, and we got along so great. And it's just, it just the 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 family vibe that yeah, has yeah. occurred here is as been like something I've never experienced before honestly and so. everybody that's here is meant to be here and deserves to be here and I think that's Thanks. important to remember <laughs> because it's very easy to be like oh I'm here because my friend put me on here but like we wouldn't put you here if we didn't think that 
you work harder and are more dedicated and have more drive than all the other people that I was considering to That's put nice. in your place. Right yeah, <laughs> I'm looking at you and talking yeah. to you at the same time. But for every single one of you, and the same yeah. goes for Frankie too, yeah. the two Franks. Oh. Like, I know that you worked your butt off and that you deserve to be here. And, and when Marco t talked to me about the opportunity of trying to get you here to America, I was like, that's such a huge thing that we have the power to be able to do, and that's sick. Yeah. So I actually want to say something about that, because yeah. uh, I'm not sure a lot of people know about this, but uh, yeah, I've been doing music for 13, 14 years, something like that. And uh, obviously, like 90% of all my plays and stuff is in the States, right? So I have to go to the States to play music. But for in order to me, for me to get to the States and play events, I need to have a visa. And that was the thing that was holding me back all the time, because uh, in order to get a visa, you need to... Uh, show the government that you actually have shows that you do a bit of work but in order to get shows you need to have a visa so it's like this vicious circle yeah. that's mm -hmm. you need to going like, on mass a certain amount of booking requests and right. other things like uh, blog posts or some news articles or something that are from the US from my yeah. yeah. mm -hmm. how actually a, like how much yeah. that actually helps having yeah. blog support and write ups really helps yeah. Yeah. Letters, All letters of, it. of recommendation from other people from the US yeah. that you can then add to you have to like hand in this whole stack because I had to do the same thing obviously coming from Germany I also had to get a visa right. uh, visa, and uh, and it, it's this whole bureaucracy bureaucracy thing so I'm so glad that worked out oh, uh, yeah. and if you had yeah, no yeah, thanks, this, 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 and this, uh, all I these tour stops were his first yeah. time in the uh, in the US I'm, I'm uh, and thanks. I'm very honored to be have been able to facilitate that yeah. 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 and after so meeting much, you it's oh, even better because yeah. after yeah. meeting you it's like oh this is this was an even better decision than we originally like thought you know what I mean so yeah Brother, this guy's a brother for life, and I promise I'm not just saying that because he's the second Frank, okay? Not to cut, <laughs> not to cut anyone off, but what? when are we going on? Because I yeah. really yeah, need yeah, to yeah, pee. We, we can <laughs> and, uh, you can just go, go and we'll yeah, continue. Wait, so okay, and we have to say hi to some homies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, yes. I, I think we did it. 45 minutes. Yeah, well, actually, that's quite cool. 32. Wait, uh, but I think thir 11, 12, till changeover, though. Changeover. Gotcha. 30 I'm minutes. Sure we're till we're changeover. gonna do another one like this yeah. later on, yeah. but this was the last show that we did with Frank, so I really wanted to have him on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. like right after my show, we were set this up to do this really quick, yeah. so. That's yeah. Well, that sums it's it up, awesome. right? Like we were just working so hard to get everything like ready for you guys, and yeah. uh, I hope you enjoyed this, and uh, we'll see you next time. Yeah, yeah. see you later. Yeah. Love you guys. Yeah. <laughs>